Industrial controllers are affected by supply bottlenecks. Due to overpriced chips and components, the costs of available hardware devices are exploding. This is the situation that manufacturers and operators of machinery and equipment are currently facing. But digitalization creates wonderful new opportunities, such as virtual industrial controllers. How exactly do they work? The tangible substructure of control technology has become increasingly detached from the software. This abstraction has proven its worth. With containers and hypervisors, the entire PLC is now virtualized, just as is the case with virtual drives. Description files define the functions of the virtualized device, such as programmability according to IEC 61131-3, visualization, communication, or motion control. With coded processing, even safety applications up to SIL-3 according to IEC 61508 can be realized. I.O. access takes place as usual in real time via virtual LAN using Ethernet-based protocols. Manufacturers and operators can now switch to any devices as needed. For example, open industrial platforms, IPCs, or IT servers. Several physical PLCs are replaced by one powerful hardware. The result? Significant cost savings in procurement, installation, operation, and updates, as well as new freedom in device selection. The application can be divided into virtual controllers, like microservices and information technology. IT security is massively hardened through encapsulation. CodeSys Virtual Control SL from the IEC 61131-3 market leader is the answer to the current challenges. Come and see for yourself. The free demo version is available in the CodeSys store.